We are hours away from a partial government shutdown unless the Senate passes a spending bill by midnight. If not, some operations at the Departments of Homeland Security, Defense, Education and several others will be impacted. Fox's Rebecca Castor has the latest from Washington. Let's finish the job today. Let's avoid even a weekend shutdown. There is no reason to delay. It's now up to the Senate to pass a spending bill by midnight and avoid a partial government shutdown. These bipartisan, bicameral bills are the results of many months of hard work. Congress can still work, but only when we come to the negotiating table in good faith and leave politics at the door. But with some senators wanting to add amendments to the bill, it could take hours for it to pass. The House approved the $1.2 trillion package this morning, but Republican House Speaker Mike Johnson is not off the hook yet. I think this speaker failed miserably today. Some GOP lawmakers are angry the bill doesn't include more cuts on spending or stricter border security measures. And Georgia's Marjorie Taylor Greene has filed a motion to oust Johnson from the speakership. We but need a new speaker. This is not personal against Mike Johnson. He's a very good man, and I, I have respect for him as a person, but he is not doing the job. The proof is in the vote count. Green calls the motion a warning, but if she brings it to a vote with Republicans shrinking majority, they could lose the speaker seat to a Democrat. If the Senate does not pass the bill tonight, lawmakers are expected to work through the weekend to get the government funded. In Washington, Rebecca Castor, Fox News. From